We got married too fast. Oof. <laughs> wow. <laughs> what? You agree that we got married too fast? We did get married pretty fast. Like... I have it here for a specific reason. Should I go? Sure. I have it on disagree because our circumstances, obviously in the grand scheme of things, this is how it was supposed to be. So I disagree yes. that that is a true statement. But I would not advise everyone to get married as, as fast as we did. Mm -hmm. It's really like dependent on the scenario. I think that's also why I'm in agree and not like strongly agree or anything because looking at our timeline, mm -hmm. like it was really fast yeah. and I feel like we didn't fully get to enjoy the engagement season because it was like, we were engaged for three months. Yeah, but it would have been another year of long distance. No, I know. Yeah, so that's I why I'm like- Considering- It's the circumstances, know. you know? It is the circumstance, but if the circumstances were different, I think like a longer- We probably would have waited a little longer if yeah. we were not across the Pacific Ocean from each other. Yes. Yeah. Guys, we've seen other YouTubers play this game. We've seen F1 drivers play this game on YouTube. We've seen Tom Holland and Zendaya play this game. So naturally we thought, let's give the internet what it wants most. Our opinions. We have done it a little different. We have different levels to it. We're starting with easy level and it's working its way to hard level. And the last questions at the end are the most juiciest. Level easy. Okay. We did not start easy with that first question. This is easy. Is it? Gabriel has better style. Mm. Three, two, one. I think we actually have similar style, but in the scale of men's fashion, if this was like the men's fashion scale right here, this is like really good and really bad, I would say I'm farther up on the men's fashion scale than you I are on the woman's the guess, fashion yes. scale. Honestly, women's fashion is so complicated. Get me a good pair of jeans, a nice shirt layered over, you know, like throw a sweater on or something. It's like easier. You do have a natural eye for it though, whereas I feel like I just go for things that are really simple, but also in my defense. You're a mom now. I'm a mom. Yeah. Your closet, everything looks the same. Whereas mm. I feel like girls have crop tops, oversized things. You just have like t-shirts, long sleeves. Hoodies. Yeah, it's, it's all symmetrical. Jess spends more money. Hmm. Oh, this is difficult. Three, two, one. Care to explain yourself? I would love to know your answer first. My answer is that you spend more money consistently. You'll buy things, maybe it's new clothes or whatever. You come to me more often and go, I bought another thing. But when I spend money, it's like very specific and typically in a larger quantity. Yes. I go, babe, bought a new lens oops, where you're like, babe, bought some shorts, but yeah, you yeah. bought enough shorts over time and enough like random things, a new kettle you wanted the other day. I'm like, babe, our kettle's fine. And all of that I think adds up to more than the amount I spend on like the one-off bigger things. I would say I spend more because I buy for the whole household, mm. not in a rude way. Yours is like a selfless no, spending. No, it's not. Yeah. <laughs> But like, I buy all of my guys' clothes. Yeah. I buy the furniture. I want the new kettle. Okay, but that's the furniture, like, that's, I'm not accounting that. Oh, I am. I'm saying in general. All right, then Jess spends way more than me. <laughs> Ooh, off the scale. Last easy one. Gabriel is the more jealous one. Three, two, one. Wow, I'm surprised that the you thing said is, agree. Uh, yeah, no, it depends in the scope of time. Beginning of the relationship, I would have gone here because I had way more issues from my past relationship with like trust. Okay, I feel like we're not really jealous now. We're very like secure in our marriage. Yeah, that's what in I'm terms saying. Of, like, I didn't the know. The start of the relationship, I still would have gone here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Fair enough. Fair enough. Like when I was doing vines and stuff and meeting up with random people and collabing and stuff, you would feel really weird that I was just like hanging out with like some random people and there was like a chick there I was shooting a video with or something. Like. Well, not exactly that, but like when I first met you, I thought that you liked someone else. And then when we first announced our relationship, I got a lot of hate because people were telling me that Gabe was dating the wrong girl and that like he should be dating this person and blah, blah, blah. And mm -hmm. I think that in itself like would make me jealous of like the thought of that. Yeah, that's fair. That's fair. I feel like we're pretty trusting yeah. at this point. Good job. First level medium. Jess starts more arguments. Three, two, two one. one. <gasps> no. See, like I, from my perspective, it's it's there. I think start is maybe the wrong word, but do you want to know why I'm here? Why are you here? I don't think I start arguments. I think I want to be silent and left alone. I think you start arguments because you are like, what's wrong? Did okay, I'm wrong? not starting the argument. I just want to talk about it. I don't know, but technically- Okay, see, I think it's different. I'm trying to resolve it. In, in that moment, but I know you're upset and then you just like I want, want to get like, over it myself. Like, so technically we're both right. I guess <laughs> I'm trying to be agreeable here. Jess don't start another argument. Oh my god. <laughs> I don't like my spouse's family Three, Three two, two one 
That was pretty easy. That should have been in the easy one. I just thought it was juicy. It's I... juicy if there's like juice, juice beneath the surface, you know? There's no juice. Flirting is cheating. Three, two, mm -hmm. one. Ah. Oh. Ah. If you flirted with another girl, I wouldn't be like, he cheated on me. Yeah. This but is it... my thing. If you were to flirt with another guy, that's much more easier to mend in a relationship than if you were to have slept with another guy. Yeah. Like, yes. But there's levels to it, you know. I would be upset. Yeah, yeah, that happened. would be that would be the worst. What would be worse than the worst was if it went way farther than that. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, exactly. Okay. But it's also like if you're intentionally flirting with someone, mm -hmm. then I think that's way worse. Oh yeah, 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 for sure. This is the last of the medium. Level yeah. medium. Marriage is hard. Three, two, two one. one. I could have gone both ways. Pre having children, I would have been here. Yeah. For us, it's been relatively seamless, yeah. other than like a few things that we've gone through. But I say agree because now with a child, the amount of effort we have to put into like making sure that we're putting in time for our marriage just because we have one kid, it's drastically more difficult than before. I respect that opinion. The way that I view it is that the marriage itself isn't hard. Uh, I think it's life. I think life is continually going to come up. But marriage, like we're a team. Yeah. We're each other's best friend. I don't think that's the hard part. Even what you were saying, I think it's more like now the time is the hard part. I don't mm. think the marriage is. Yeah. These are the hard ones. Level hard, baby. We look happier on social media than we are. Hmm. This one's a sliding scale. Three, two, two one. one. It's hard because I'd say disagree because I think we are very happy just in our life off social media. Mm -hmm. The reason I say agree is because we post the good parts. If you look at our social media, we're happy 100% of the time. Think For the most part. It's also how people perceive us as well. To me, I'm like, we're happier off social media, but like from a yeah, third party, someone could look and be like, oh my gosh, they're so happy. Yeah, yeah, true. But I feel like that's the case with everyone. Yeah, yeah. But I think in general, because most people just show their highlights. Mm -hmm. Real life is just way more messy and way more complicated. Unfiltered. There's so much more going on and so much more complication and messiness and moving pieces than what you see on social media. Mm -hmm. Now we have three more juicy questions, but... I have a book! <laughs> I am so excited to announce that I have a guided journal, day by day, 100 ways to capture memories and create your own story. Guys, I don't think you understand. When Jess showed it to me for the first time, I was floored at the quality. Like, it's like a Bible. It has like the little tag like a Bible. It's bound. The cover is like this beautiful little linen-y texture. Oh. It's just so good. And the content inside is amazing. Jess has been working on it for years. I have been working on this for years and it's just something that I hope brings you a lot of peace and um, something that you can just have some me time with. Whether it's putting your phone away for a little bit or like sitting on the couch with your comfort chair in the background. I think you will really love it. What I think is really cool about it is there is the lighthearted stuff that's a lot more like relaxed chill, but then there's stuff that really makes you think and grow and stuff that is maybe challenging you to, to grow personally. Thank you. It's true. He's my little spokesperson. <laughs> Anyway, it is out for pre-order, so I'll leave the link down below. I'm so excited for you guys to see. Next level hard, baby. I have considered divorce. <laughs> Three, two, two one. one. Only like a time, like, I mean, obviously I'm here, but I think I have to be honest. You've thought about it? Yeah, yeah, I've thought about okay, it. Okay, that's different. Like, I've thought about, I wonder what would happen if Jess and I got divorced. Yeah, That'd yeah. be weird. That's a considered. I've considered it as an option that I'd like to take. Exactly. Absolutely not. Yes. Off the table. But I fear it. I pray that never happens. Like, I've thought about it. Yeah, that's so different. That's not considering it. That's thinking of if <laughs> that were to happen at some point. Okay. That's gay. Uh, I was like, when? Oh, I just kidding. <laughs> we had a baby too young. Three, two, one. You're like, I'm nearly 30. <laughs> I'm getting old. I think people would probably look at me because I had her when I was 25. Yeah, yeah, true. But like 28 for me, well, I was 27 technically, math. Whew. 28 with a three month old, that's a pretty normal age. I think to have it's a baby. all relative. Like if you're 30, and you just got married, don't have a kid until you're maybe 31 or 32 so you can enjoy the marriage. Right. But we got married at 22 and 20, so like, exactly. I'm saying strongly disagree because we could have, three years in, had a kid and things been fine. I'm so happy when we fell pregnant and like, it was the perfect timing. Mm -hmm. But I do think I was pregnant at 25. I think some people would see that as too young. Also relative, 
for the amount of time that we've been married, mm -hmm. I feel like it was a really good time. Would you do the honors on the final, final hard question? Our marriage is worse now that we have a baby. Three, Three two, two, one. one. Strongly disagree. I think so. It's hard because kind of what we were talking about before, I think we just don't have as much time for just our marriage, but I think our family now is so much better. We have so much more love in us now because of her Yeah. that I wouldn't say at all that it has become worse. I put it on disagree because I would say our marriage has not gotten worse. It has gotten more like difficult kind of what we explained before on that earlier question it has gotten more difficult we have less time for each other all that stuff it hasn't gotten worse no not at all it takes more effort to keep it at the same caliber of what it was prior to having a child but you know i think i love you more now than i ever have because i was like trying not to smell when i said that <laughs> because of how i like see you with her and uh -huh. it's okay thanks babe. it's quick i'd agree with that like how you are with her as well like it's changed my perspective of you and i guess like just completely changes your the perspective in a relationship drink to that cheers